so there we are. Now we have three Wacom appetizer, the sturgeon from uh, an ancient uh, uh, Bartolomeo Scappi recipe uh, dated the uh, 14th century. We have sturgeon cooked uh, in uh, mallet wine, uh, vegetables, sweet and sour, and uh, uh, mustard, uh, seed mustard. And then on the side uh, we have uh, sea scallops, uh, they are par fry, parsnip, uh, cream of uh, parsnip and nervetti. Nervetti are cartilage, uh, veal cartilage. And then uh, on the top uh, you have uh, a very traditional Venetian preparation. You have uh, um, shrimps marinated in sour. They are onion sweet and sour, saffron and curcuma, raisins, pine nuts and white grapes. So the first wine to go is a, a Metodo Classico, it's a, it is a local Metodo Classico, so um, produced in the area called Monti Lessini, not too far from Verona. The grape used, it is the Durella, it's a very typical grape from our region. Uh, there is a 15% of Manzoni Bianco, another typical grape from our region as well. This wine uh, is a finished 48 months on the lease. So what they call uh, champagne in France, in Italy it's called Metodo Classico. It means that the wine make is double fermentation into the bottle. Cork is perfect. This is a, a Humberjack Tartare. It is a serve with a, a radish, sweet and sour, chives mayonnaise, seaweed pesto, and the crispy flax. Thank you. The wine that you would like uh, to pair with your uh, Humberjack, it is a, a very unique wine, a very rare grape, <clears throat> a grape that has been saved by the winemaker Emilio Bulfon. We are in Friuli region. The name of this grape is called Cividine or Blanca de San Juan. It is a medium to full body wine, very fresh and crispy white wine. This is the only wine in the world where we can find this type of grape. And the cork is perfect.
So this is our uh, ravioli. It is a uh, one of our must, uh, always in our menu. Uh, in this plate, uh, we find the uh, big tradition of the historical with the historical Venetian cuisine. In fact, uh, in the past, uh, the spice and the sugar during the Repubblica Serenissima was uh, most expensive than gold. And in this plate, uh, we find the spice and the sugar that the Venetian used uh, to put uh, in big quantity in uh, their kitchen. The ravioli are homemade, they are filled with different types of cheeses. Then we have uh, saffron sauce, aromatic herbs, uh, almonds, uh, and uh, of course the crossed brown sugar to try together with the ravioli at the same time. Thank you. Wine uh, that go with this uh, full body and aromatic plate is a full body and aromatic wine, but uh, it is the most uh, traditional white wine for Venice. The Malvasia wine is a wine, uh, the, the, the wine with a great uh, tradition in Venice, even if it is not Italian. It is a wine produced in Croatia. And uh, some hundred years ago, Croatia was part of Venice. And the wine that arrived from Croatia was the most important in the world. The Venetian used to sell this wine all over in the world. Uh, some of the streets in Venice are dedicated to this wine. So they are called Calle della Malvasia, so with the same name of the wine. We have Bridge della Malvasia, Sotto Portico della Malvasia, so that they remember this uh, very famous Venetian, Venetian local wine. It's a full body white, it is uh, aged in oak barrel. It is uh, as big and as aromatic as the plate that, you, that you orders. It is a 2017. It has been awarded as best uh, as a best Malvasia in Croatia. So it's a very special wine. Cork is perfect. So this is our uh, raw and cook risotto. It is a risotto prepared with a fennel broth. Then at the end, uh, at the end we add uh, uh, cream of fennel, parmesan cheese and butter. Cook and raw fish, bitterroot powder and a touch of licorice. And then at the end uh, we add some anetto. We have been awarded with this risotto in a competition called Risotto del Sommelier and uh, we have been chosen uh, for the restaurant in Venice uh, and uh, we, bring the, the, we have been awarded as a best risotto of the, of the region. And of course uh, there were a pairing, a wine pairing with this risotto that was very very special and uh, it was with this wine called From Black to White. Is the white wine I would like to serve you now. It is a, a unique wine produced with a grape called Rondinella, a white Rondinella. And this is the only wine in the world with this type of grape that has been created by Zime Winery. Zime is one of the most important producers of Amarone and the Rondinella is one of the grapes used for the Amarone. But in, in this case, white Rondinella. So this is the name from black to white. It's a clonal mutation of this wine. It's a very uh, interesting white wine with a lot of aroma. As a lot of aroma as this uh, risotto. Uh, there is a 60% of the Rondinella white, as I told you, and the rest of the grapes uh, are aromatics uh, like Golden Traminer, Kerner, and Manzoni. It is affinated in steel vats, and the harvest is the 2019. Thank you. 
also. This is another of the historical Venetian preparation, very, very uh, famous in Venice, and it is the Bisato Inara. It means uh, smoked hill. It is cooked at a low temperature, and then in the pan uh, to make it crispy the skin. It is served uh, with a sauce prepared with different type of peppers, uh, a touch of green apple jelly, and uh, on the base of the hill uh, you have a grilled polenta. It is a plate uh, that uh, the people that used to work in the glass factory some, some years ago, they used to bring the fresh hill in the morning, bring in sea water when it was possible okay and uh, they put uh, the sea water the eel and a lot of peppers and aromatic herbs uh, beside the oven and uh, cooking very very slow so uh, the, in the evening the eel was ready to eat we do more or less uh, the same thing of course we don't use the sea water <laughs> wine uh, to go I love this wine. It is another indigenous grape from Friuli region, so the region next to Venice. It is called Schioppettino Ribolla Nera 2019. I love the pairing with, this, with the eel because it is a little bit spicy, like the sauce that you have on the plate. It is very elegant, soft in tannins, and uh, the, the alcohol it is quite low, but long persistence, sir. This is our dessert. It is a chocolate lingotto with a iced raspberry and a raspberry ice cream. A crumb of a coconut and a chocolate chips. Wine that I would like to give you to try is a very unique uh, uh, dessert wine produced in the region. There is only one producer in the world using this type of grape that is called Wildbacher. It's a grape originally that came in our region 200 years ago from Austria. And actually, as I told you, there is only one producer of this uh, type of wine. Only 400 bottles are produced. And uh, if the harvest is perfect, otherwise uh, they don't produce this one. So, it's a very interesting red wine, sweet. Because uh, you have the uh, sugar, uh, natural sugar left, uh, not fermented, that is very well balanced from the tannins uh, of the Wildbacher. And the tannins of the Wildbacher are very, very uh, intense. This is a Coravan system that helps us uh, to serve the red wines, uh, all the wines in a perfect shape. Ciao, ciao.